Larry's at the point where he's having so much trouble walking now. He takes 20 pills a day, and this is the week. We've called the physician to increase his cinnamon dose, and that will increase his side effects. My uh, symptoms are a great deal more obvious than they were before. And the pain is a little sharper. Hello? Hi, Hi Larry. My name is Dr. Blake. I'm Larry Smith. Nice to meet you. So, Larry, have you ever used medical marijuana before? No. The goal of treatment with Parkinson's patients, or with any medical marijuana patients for that matter, is to decrease the symptoms of your qualifying condition by using the least amount of uh, medical marijuana possible. These are not the days of free from madness. Yet I and millions of other people, millions of other people, can't have it, can't have it without facing serious jail time. Now to a warning. Arizona's new medical marijuana law is resulting in some people ending up in handcuffs. You might have a medical marijuana card, but you could still end up being arrested even if you're a qualifying medical marijuana patient. These are people who believe they are operating within the confines of the law, but that's apparently getting some of them arrested. Just a few miles from here in Oregon, medical marijuana is legal. But under the Controlled Substances Act, marijuana remains illegal in the eyes of the federal government. 25-year-old Brianna Bilbray is battling stage 3 melanoma cancer. While undergoing chemotherapy treatments, she smokes marijuana to help deal with nausea. This medicine helped me within seconds. She's also the daughter of Republican Congressman Brian Bilbray. And now she is suing the federal government. The federal laws about marijuana are schizophrenic. We're talking about marijuana is just as bad as methamphetamine, which, you know, it isn't. It simply isn't. It's a plant that has a chemical in it, and this chemical does uh, some good things and does some bad things, and the good things uh, we appreciate and the bad things we try to avoid. It doesn't seem to me as a big deal. You think the cops all swear me 100%? Yeah, I was so damn me. I do not like the idea of breaking federal law. Um, you know, even though it's the state law is in California is very clear that it's permissible. Um, I'm, I'm still uncomfortable. Um, but, um, you know, I, I, if this is the only thing, and as far as I know, we've tried everything, and this is the only thing um, that's left. And so we are, we are going to give it a go and see how it goes.